It's your boy right here on the wood wheels of Steve Deal. Steve Dave Don King. Check this out. Hello, welcome to the wonderful community. In today's video, we are going to be just playing around with the keyboard to look at some little DJing stuff that we have been doing over a period of time. So we don't be talking much. So if you are a DJ, you get to appreciate the essence of why you need to constantly learn. And if you are not a DJ, you get to appreciate why DJs are always moving their fingers around when they are playing songs. So, why are the DJs always moving their fingers around when they are playing song? The bitter tool there is for you to really perfect that concept of entertainment as a DJ. It requires a lot of training and a lot of resources, which means at the end of the day, it's going to cost you a lot of things. It's going to cost you money, time and effort, which you as an event planner, you need to really put DJs into consideration because there is nothing really easy about DJing. For some people, they came into it, they thought it's something is just about playing songs. As time goes on, they got to realize that ah, the responsibility that comes with this thing is bigger than what they initially planned for. So at the end of the day, they get to fizzle out. Song can no longer compete with the constant update and changes that is coming into the industry. But if you don't need to give up, you have to continuously push because that is what makes life what it is. So what we are going to be looking at is just playing around the song so remember as a dj when you are starting you get to look at the entire structure of the song what and what is at what level what is happening at every stage of the song that will give you an idea on how you can play around the song because the essence of djing is to continuity of the entertainment that's what makes it different from just playing individual tracks so that means you require to learn a lot about the song the identification of the beat the tempo the ppm the key the harmonic key and the rest of them then you go for that to look at how to count your beat as you count your beat you get to look at other stuff around beat then from there you will now begin to look at identification of this key feature you are going to be putting in your hot cues how you start a song now look at your scratches from your scratches you will now get to look at how to put all these things together to having a very perfect transitioning from one track to another so I believe you already have an idea of just this is just like a simple guide if you are just coming across the channel for the very first time because that is what you are actually dealing with in this channel. And as time goes on, you begin to look at your branding. How do you brand yourself? Then as you are going into branding, you begin to look at a much more advanced technique on how to put yourself out there using social media and the rest of them. So you are going for that. So, uh, but however, in this channel, I'm just going to be playing around here to get to see what I'm doing here. So, let's get to enjoy it. It's your boy right here on the wheels of Deal. It's DDD Dave Don Genius. Check this out. 